Hey, did you see that asteroid passing by? Not really, I'm more focused on the show prep. Right. Sorry. Got distracted for a moment. No worries, happens to the best of us. Guys, we are going live in 3, 2, 1. Ladies and gentlemen, today we're diving into a crucial development in the Netherlands that affects cycling events across municipalities. Picture this. Vibrant race like the Amstel Gold Race and Limbour Moist. Where cyclist pedals roosting landscapes. Capturing the essence of the sport and the beauty of the region. Ah, the Netherlands, where even the bike races are as intense as their tulip auctions. But here's the catch. A recent decision has been made to adjust the rules governing these events. What does this mean? Well, it's all about balance. While the thrill of this cycling tour is celebrated, there's a need to ensure they don't overwhelm the communities they pass through. Focus, please. What's the matter now, Debbie? Probably upset because her coffee's cold again. Yeah, Debbie's so cold. Her coffee wants to warm up. She should have known better. No, it's not about the coffee. It's about trust. Trust? What happened? Spill the space beans, Debbie. Let's hear it, then. Someone's been tampering with the food Who supplies. Who would do such a thing? Maybe it's just a malfunction. Or maybe it's sabotage. We need to find out who's responsible. Looks like the mystery of the missing snacks has become our very own culinary hoodoo. This is serious. Indeed. Oh, the drama of it all. Can't trust anyone these days. We'll get to the bottom of this. Going live again. So, what's the solution? It's simple yet significant. Ah, the old KISS principle. Keep it simple. Stupefyingly significant. Authorities have agreed to allow these events to continue, preserving their essence and excitement. However, there's a twist. The number of events permitted is now limited. This adjustment is crucial to maintain harmony between the joy of cycling and the peace of local life. Can we try to act like professionals for once? What's wrong now, Debbie? Probably upset because her lunch was late. Always something with her. It's not about my lunch, it's about teamwork. Teamwork? Ah, teamwork. The fine art of blaming others for your mistakes together. Did something happen? Spill the beans, Debbie. Let's hear the drama, then. Charlie and Bert are at odds again. We need to help them reconcile. Let's hear the drama, then. Let's hear the drama, then. Okay, here we go again. We're live. Ah, the never-ending saga of human conflict. Like Ground Duck Day, but with more drama and less Bill Murray. Think of it as finding the perfect tempo in a symphony. Not too loud, not too soft, but just right. It's about respecting the beauty of both the sport and the community. Now, let's break it down further. Imagine you're a curious extraterrestrial or a bright eyed five year old digger to understand. Think of these cycling events as grand adventures where brave riders embark on journeys through town and countryside, cheered on by crowds of fans. It's like watching heroes on a quest, except their steeds are sleep bikes and the finish line is their triumph. So, basically, it's like watching a tour de force, but with more spandex and less Shakespeare. Pat, can we please focus on the topic? What's the issue now, Debbie? Probably upset because she can't control us. Let's get on with it. It's about Roger and Han. What's happening with them? Tell us more, Debbie. We're standing together, despite differences. Admirable teamwork, Roger. Oh, the power of robot French. We're more than just machines. They're strong, you, and Let's learn from their unity. 
It won't last, mark my words. We'll prove you wrong, Carl. Yeah, like they say, keep your friends close and your toaster oven closer. In three, two, one, we're live. But some time, these adventures can become overwhelming, like a storm disrupting a peaceful day. That's where the day of limits comes in. Just as we set boundaries for playtime or bedtime routines, so too must we set limits on these cycling events. Ah oh yes, because too much cycling can really tire out those spokes. It's not about saying no to fun. It's about ensuring that everyone gets a fair share of the excitement without it becoming too much. It's like taking the turns on a swing everyone gets a chance to soar. So, what does this mean for the Netherlands in 2024? Can we stay on track, please? What's the matter now? Debbie? Probably upset because she can't control us. Let's just hear her out. It's about Bob and Alice. What about us, Debbie? Sounds juicy. Spill it, Debbie. Probably another petty argument. Ah, the eternal drama of Bob and Alice, the only thing more predictable than our sorbet. They're struggling to find common ground. We need to work on our unity. Oh, the human drama unfolds. We can't even get along in space. Let's help them through this, guys. We'll find a way, together. I'll believe it when I see it. Just another day on this floating tin can. Live in three, two, one. Did you catch the last episode? Yes, I did. Quite the spectacle. What are your thoughts on it? I found it lacking depth. Indeed, the discussion felt surface level. Bob and Alice seemed oblivious. It's as if they're just going through the motions. Can they ever truly engage? Only time will tell, Roger. Perhaps, but I won't hold my breath. 